It continues it, it, this is a to, to rattle earthquake. pretty strong here. 821 here on the air. We're experiencing very strong shaking. Wow. I think we need to get under the desk. All right, we're going to go to break. Uh, we'll, we'll be, be right, right back, back after we'll be this. Right back. Wow. Beneath the sun-scorched expanse of Nevada and Eastern California, ancient geologic forces awaken in ways few imagined possible. On a cold morning, at precisely 7.16 a.m. Eastern Time, a sharp tremor rattles the ground near Caliente, Nevada, sending shockwaves underfoot and raising concern throughout the scientific community. But this is no isolated event. Seven earthquakes, capped by a magnitude 4.8, ripple through the region, each one an echo from deep within the Earth. For years, scientists have peered into the shadowy depths beneath the Sierra Nevada, tracing shifting fractures and sensing the slow, relentless motions of the planet. Now, with compelling new data, unusual earthquake patterns, and the rare discovery of what seems to be cracks deep in the Earth's crust, geologists are sounding the alarm. The United States Geological Survey, the nation's premier authority on seismic activity, closely monitors these developments, with alert systems ready for escalation in times of heightened risk. What does it mean when the earth beneath our feet begins to peel away in silence? Are we witnessing just another tremor, or the opening act of a geologic story, millions of years in the making, as experts work to decipher the magnitude and implications of Nevada's recent tremors and deep earth cracks, each new data point raises a pressing question. What underground secrets are the Sierra Nevada and neighboring regions preparing to reveal? Can the fractures of the past help forecast the earthquakes of tomorrow? Or is something new taking shape beneath the American West? Tremors in the desert, Nevada's recent seismic surge Nevada's rugged deserts, shaped over millennia, have always known the restlessness of the Earth. But recent weeks have drawn urgent scientific scrutiny for good reason. The routine stillness near Caliente was disrupted by a sequence of seven tremors, peaking with a magnitude 4.8 event that reverberated through homes and businesses across the region. To residents, the shaking was brief. To geologists, it carried a weightier message a signal of deeper, more significant geophysical processes. Why did these particular earthquakes emerge now? And what sets them apart? The United States Geological Survey quickly cataloged and analyzed the quakes, looking for patterns and clues in their sequence. Their findings were concerning. The quake's distribution and depth diverged from more typical seismic swarms and hinted at origins not just in familiar faults, but possibly at greater depths, suggestive of activity below the well-mapped surface. Meanwhile, in another notable event, on December 9th, a magnitude 5.7 earthquake struck Lyon County and surrounding areas. Its force was enough to be felt well beyond its epicenter and to reignite important discussions about earthquake preparedness and scientific understanding in Nevada. In response to the recent activity, the USGS estimated a 27% chance of another quake measuring 3.0 or greater in the week following the event, a notably elevated risk for the area. In Texas, too, a magnitude 5.0 quake near Toya in Reeves County was powerful enough to rupture a natural gas pipeline, an incident that highlights how earthquakes while local in occurrence, can have cascading impacts on infrastructure, communities, and economies. Though geologically separate from Nevada's sequence, the Texas quake served as a vivid reminder that the wider region remains subject to ongoing tectonic forces. In laboratories and field stations, scientists examine streams of seismic data for patterns that might forecast future quakes or illuminate the origins of recent tremors. Are these events linked by a deeper process, a previously unrecognized rupture, or are they isolated consequences of the West's famously dynamic geology? 
earth peeling, geologists uncover a tectonic mystery. In the aftermath of these seismic episodes, geologists, including experts such as Dr. Bohan, intensified their investigations into Nevada's and the Sierra Nevada's deep crust. Using a blend of seismic analysis, advanced imaging, and careful review of earthquake histories, researchers pieced together new evidence. The Earth's crust beneath Nevada might not simply be shaking, it may be peeling. But what does it mean, in scientific terms, for the planet's crust to peel away? Through the application of seismic tomography and other imaging technologies, researchers have uncovered rare, compelling signs that enormous slabs of the continental crust are detaching from the base of the Sierra Nevada. This process, what geologists call delamination, can lead to major shifts in the structure and composition of entire regions over time. Imagine the ancient walls of the Earth, long considered solid, slowly detaching, guided by fractures and the upward pressure of underlying rock. In Nevada, recent earthquake data and geological profiles have revealed cracks and separations deep beneath the surface in rocks that have endured for eons. This discovery is significant. Never before have scientists had access to such detailed real-time evidence of crustal peeling in an area as geologically pivotal as the Sierra Nevada. The implications reach beyond Nevada and Eastern California, potentially affecting our broader understanding of tectonic activity in Western North America. With each new data set, the evidence grows stronger. Geological sensors pick up gradual movement, blocks of crust rising, falling, and thinning. Earthquake swarms, once attributed primarily to known faults, are now being reconsidered in light of evidence for deeper, more complex processes like delamination. If the crust is indeed peeling beneath Nevada, recent quakes and cracks are more than just incidental. They are signals of fundamental changes that could unfold over decades to centuries. Living on the edge, the human cost, and scientific challenge. While scientists pursue new understanding, the human dimension is ever-present. What do ongoing crustal changes mean for people living in Nevada, California, and across the tectonic west? In Lyon County, Nevada, the magnitude 5.7 quake spurred officials to action. Early warning systems, previously the subject of debate and bureaucratic delay, have gained renewed support. Letters and proposals to enhance seismic preparedness are now on the desks of decision makers, propelled by the lived memory of trembling floors and swaying buildings. For people living across Caliente, Lyon County, and other towns on the edges of the Sierra Nevada, every tremor is a reminder that the earth below is not unchanging. The prospect of infrastructure damage, cracked roads, disrupted pipelines, and interrupted daily life lends urgency and personal significance to the scientific investigations. For researchers, the challenge goes beyond technical expertise. How do you prepare for geological changes so novel that their full scope is just emerging? Dr. Bohan and her colleagues confront both the promise and the uncertainty inherent in breakthrough science, the possibility that new technology can provide early warnings, even if it cannot prevent underlying tectonic shifts. Emergency planners are recalibrating risk maps and evacuation plans. Delamination and deep crust cracking pose potential new hazards, not just redrawing land surfaces, but challenging the stability of regions that millions call home. The Texas pipeline rupture stands as a vivid cautionary tale, not driven by error, but by the unpredictable movements of the earth. Among indigenous communities and long-term residents, memories of past quakes mingle with oral histories about the cycles of fire, tremor, and landscape change. Whether interpreted through science or tradition, the central question remains, if the earth is peeling beneath us, what does the future hold? The Red Alert, understanding USGS's response. The language of seismology often uses color-coded alert levels and aviation color codes, especially for volcanic eruptions, to communicate risk. Red Alert typically signals the highest level of monitoring and readiness. Most commonly associated with imminent or ongoing volcanic activity rather than ordinary earthquakes. 
For earthquakes, the USGS does update alert levels for local officials and the public, and it issues aftershock forecasts and potential hazards, while color-coded systems may be used internally or in specific programs, the recent sequence of Nevada earthquakes has generated a heightened level of concern and prompted robust monitoring from the USGS. The estimated 27% chance of another significant quake within a week underscores both the uncertainty and the need for vigilance. In the scientific community, these alerts serve as clarion calls to focus attention, scrutinize every new tremor, and use every tool available to understand unfolding events. For communities, heightened alerts mean paying close attention to official guidance, staying prepared, and recognizing that seismic hazards are ever-present in the tectonic west. Cracks in the foundation, imaging the deep earth. To unravel these tectonic mysteries, scientists draw on the most advanced tools available. Deep rock imaging, seismic tomography, and other technologies function like a sonogram for the Earth's subsurface, revealing features hidden far below the Nevada desert. These images show a crust in the midst of significant change. Beneath familiar landscapes, zones of rock pull apart, create new voids, and shift in unexpected ways. The crust is revealed as a patchwork of blocks and fractures, a mosaic lineated by the forces of geology. Where do these cracks lead? and what might they portend. Geologists sometimes compare Nevada's crustal activity to seismic regions like the Hellenic Arc. There, frequent earthquakes arise from complex tectonic movements. In the western U.S., however, the signature of delamination adds a new factor. As blocks of the lower crust peel away, the surface and near-surface faults may respond by releasing accumulated energy in the form of earthquakes. Earthquake arrays register subtle motion not only near surface faults, but also deep within the crust. In some places, masses of rock appear to have already separated from the base of the Sierra Nevada, triggering further readjustment and changes above. In others, newly forming cracks might provide channels for mantle heat to migrate upward, a process with geological and even economic significance. Where these cracks intersect, the potential for larger quakes or other geological changes becomes more plausible. The Earth writes its story in slow-moving events, sometimes visible only over centuries, but the consequences for today's populations can be far more immediate. Energy Unleashed – How Quakes Impact Society and Infrastructure These geological processes are far from abstract, they have real impacts on society. The rupture of a natural gas pipeline in Texas, caused by a magnitude 5.0 quake, is a stark example of how seismic events can disrupt critical infrastructure, create environmental hazards, and impose costs that stretch far beyond the initial shaking. For engineers and planners in Nevada and across the West, the emergence of deeper, less predictable seismic activity raises urgent questions. How do you design and maintain pipelines, highways, and power grids atop ground that may itself be fundamentally shifting? What measures are suitable when the changes in the crust are not yet fully mapped or understood? This resource, if harnessed safely, could offer both opportunity and challenge, especially in regions where the ground is already subject to dramatic geologic change. Whether preparing for personal safety or exploring new energy frontiers, recent tremors are reminders that society's relationship with the Earth is ever-evolving and, at times, unexpectedly fragile. A broader tectonic symphony connecting Nevada, California, Texas, and beyond. With new data illuminating Nevada's crustal evolution, scientists are considering implications for the western United States and beyond. Is crustal peeling a uniquely local event, or does it signal deeper processes sweeping the region? Looking westward, California stands as a testament to the continuous interplay of tectonic plates. The Sierra Nevada, a dramatic range dominating the landscape, sits atop critical geologic boundaries. Earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, and landslides owe much to the slow churning of the Earth's mantle 
and the shifting of massive crustal blocks. Processes like those observed beneath Nevada may cast shadows on, or even physically connect to, activity in neighboring California. Historical records suggest these forces have shaped the region over millions of years, from ancient volcanic eruptions to more recent tremors. Findings from Arizona, too, remind us that the powerful events of the deep past, eruptions, crustal thinning, and the closing and opening of ancient seas have left marks still visible today. The Limits and Promise of Science, Forecasting the Unknowable. With the flood of new data, tools, and theories, today's science is better equipped than ever to probe the inner workings of the planet. However, the complexity of processes like crustal peeling and deep earth delamination mean that, for all our progress, much remains unknown. Probabilistic forecasts, such as the USGS's 27% estimate of another 3.0 or greater quake within a week are based on statistical models that reflect both the richness and the uncertainty of modern seismology. Models can give us odds and trends, but predicting the exact timing, size, and location of future quakes remains a fundamental challenge. If certainty is out of reach, determination endures. New initiatives in seismic monitoring, ranging from expanded arrays to faster data analytics, offer hope of earlier warnings and better risk management. With every advance, communities across Nevada, California, and the broader West stand to gain knowledge, preparedness, and perhaps a sense of agency in the face of profound geophysical change. No turning back, living in a world of unfinished stories. As twilight descends over the Nevada landscape, the echoes of recent earthquakes fade replaced by the quiet anticipation of what comes next. But deep beneath the desert floor, change proceeds at its own pace, imperceptible in the moment, yet shaping the continent for generations to come. In this climate of uncertainty and inquiry, science and society work together. Each tremor, each newly revealed crack, is an opportunity to deepen understanding, to prepare, and, ultimately, to coexist with the dynamic planet we call home. Perhaps the greatest mystery is not in what we have already discovered, but in what lies ahead. In the depths of the Sierra Nevada and throughout Nevada's deserts, the Earth reveals its secrets slowly, sometimes as immediate shocks, sometimes as hints requiring decades of study. Are these cracks a record of ancient trauma or the birth pangs of a new age in North American geology? Every warning whether a statistical forecast or a news headline asks us to pay attention, learn, and remain prepared. The partnership between geology and society is ongoing, grounded in respect for the unknown and a drive for greater resilience. In the restless lands of Nevada and the Sierra Nevada, the Earth's story is far from over. What do you think? Are we witnessing just another episode in a long history? Or could these recent events signal deeper changes ahead? Share your thoughts and questions in the comments. Remember to subscribe and turn on notifications as we continue exploring the ever-evolving geology of our planet. From the deep cracks beneath Nevada all the way to the ancient stories written in Arizona's stone. Stay alert, stay curious, and remember, the story of the Earth is one we write together.